Yo, how's it going you guys? This is Diablo TCG. We have a pretty special video today. If you guys didn't know, 2021 is actually Pokemon's 25th anniversary. So throughout the year, they will be doing all kinds of festivities, starting off with these right here. If you can't tell, this is the 25th anniversary logo. And these are four card promo packs from McDonald's Happy Meals. So there's a master set of 25 cards and they are the starters from all across the different generations. They're unfortunately reprint cards. I believe they're from, I guess, the last printed version of each starter. So the last um, Squirtle Bells printed, for example, was from, I believe it's from Unbroken Bonds. And the last printed Charmander was from, um, I want to say, Burning Shadows. It's the one where Charmander's in the rain. We might pull it today and I'll show you. Um, but they all feature this 25th anniversary stamp on them. So pretty excited, it's 25 cards total in the set like I said and I'm trying to collect all of them in the hollow form. Each pack comes with 4 cards, 3 commons and 1 hollow, or 3 non hollows and 1 hollow and I think any card can be hollow so trying to get all of them in hollow and starting off strong with 12 packs. So I'm going to open these up and see what we can get, pretty excited. The first instance of the 25th anniversary celebrations are these McDonald's promo packs. I believe they're also releasing a cereal where they will also have Pokemon cards inside, so I'll be looking for those. And okay, so I guess the hollow is right on front there. So we got the Grookey in that nice shatter foil, I guess you call it. A little hollow bleed. And I think you can only get this hollow foil pattern in McDonald's cards, so that is pretty awesome. 25th anniversary stamp right there. So Grookey, Pip Love. So first pack. Got four different cards here, and I'll kind of keep track to see if we can actually put together a master set of at least the commons uh, through these 12 packs. So yeah, let's keep going. I think the chase card is probably going to be that holographic Pikachu. If it's not already going for a lot of money, it probably will be, and maybe the Charmander. And ooh, as I say that, I kind of spoiled it for myself, but there we go. I was talking about this Charmander earlier, but it is that Charmander in the rain. I believe this is from Burning Shadows. Got that nice shatter foil there. Very cool. So two down, no repeats yet. Let's see if we can get... Oh, we got a repeat Grookey, but I guess this one is non hollow so that's okay. Chikorita and Oshawott. So as far as the commons go, no dupes yet. I'm gonna sleeve up this Charmander because, you know, Charizard is super hype. Charmander is also super hype and Centering looks really good. My sentence for grading just because it'd be cool to get a PSA 10 like master set of these McDonald's promos. That'd be pretty awesome. Alright, so our two hollows so far. And we can pick up the pace once we kind of see all the cards, but yeah, really enjoying this. And this uh, pack doesn't feel like oily. I remember in the past I've definitely gotten like Yu-Gi-Oh cards I think from McDonald's back in the day and the packs are just so oily and gross but these are actually quite nice okay so I put the hollow to the back this time starting off with Froki, Poplio and a Rowlet okay so I don't think we've gotten a dupe yet that's very good and our hollow is whoa Torchic and I don't recognize this Torchic art either uh, if you guys know what set this is from, please let me know in the comments below. Okay, that's a very cool torture card. I've never seen it. I think it's a black and white set, judging from the border. Um, so I guess it's been a while since they printed the torture card. I wonder if they'll show that line some love in uh, the V sets. Like a Blazekin V would be very cool. Oh shoot. So I ripped through this pack. Um, so it looks like we have a Sobble here on the front. We have holographic Sobble. Can we get a Pikachu in this pack? No, we can't, but we did get that Squirtle. I love the Squirtle art. I think on, on Reddit, I saw someone doing a extended art version. If I can find a picture of it, I'll probably post a quick screenshot. But they extended this art essentially to be like a full art card, and it looks super awesome. So whenever I see that Squirtle, I think about that um, art piece, I guess, that you can call it, that someone did. And it's very awesome looking. So I don't think we got any dupes yet. Do a quick scan through these. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 
So, so far, out of um, the four packs we opened, we haven't gotten a dupe yet. So we're actually like halfway done with the set. That's pretty awesome. Hopefully we can get that Pikachu in at least a, um, you know, non holo Okay. Nice. Gen 2, we got the Cinequil. Gen 2 is actually my favorite set of starters. So always oh, nice to see that. Got the Cinequil, Totodile, and Cin uh, and Chikorita, of course. And there we go, we got the Pikachu. And I believe, I'm not sure if this Pikachu art was ever featured before, Squirtle, Mudkip. Okay, so we got two uh, dupes there. But very nice, got the Pikachu. So this Pikachu, I'll sweep it up too. Why not? But yeah, I'm not sure. It looks like uh, Pikachu's in a McDonald's maybe, or some kind of restaurant. It looks like a donut shop over there. But it's like some aromas wafting. Like the <laughs> trash bins over here. Um, but yeah, nice. We got our first Pikachu, and of course, that's the cool. Unfortunately, the other commons were dupes. I believe we already got the Squirtle and the, the what was it, the Mud Kit before. Yeah, so I'm gonna put those off to the side, and this is our master set so far. Still 12 cards, or 13 with the Pikachu now, so we're over half. See if we can finish it up with these final um, seven packs that we have. That would be awesome. Okay, so we got a score bunny, which I don't believe we have yet in hollow. Snivy, the Quill, and Chimchar. Let's see, I don't remember. So I know we pulled a Cyndaquil, but I'm not sure if it was only the hollow one so far. We've gotten the Snivy already. Chimchar, Cyndaquil. Okay, so Chimchar and Cyndaquil are new additions. So we are now at 15, looking for 10 more cards, and we have every card in the set. So hopefully we can get all of them. Oh, nice. And there we go, we got the Totodile. Don't think we've pulled this in common or hollow yet. That is a cool arm. Also, don't recognize where that one is from, but it looks like it's from a black and white set, which makes sense because I did not. Pull a ton from Black and White era, or it might be XY era. Black and White is quite a bit ago, so um, yeah, most likely it's X and Y actually. But very cool looking toad though. And as far as the commons go, we got Turtwig, Garita, and Mookie. It's a full grass lineup there. Let's see, are we adding any of these to our collection? We got the Grookey, we got the Chikorita, I think Turtwig is new. Nice, so got the Turtwig, which is a new addition. Yeah, I will order that later. So, nine cards. We can still do it. Five more packs. 15 cards. There's a chance. Got, oh, that's a duplicate, unfortunately. I think we got the Torchic already over here. Yeah, we do. And Squirtle, Score Bunny, and Froakie. But still gonna seal up the hollows nonetheless. Let's see, Squirtle, Score Bunny. We have a Froakie, and we have Froakie. Darn, so we didn't get anything new from that one. We're gonna at least sort these by type here, so I can have a good idea of what we've gotten so far. So that was a full dupe pack. And we have four more packs to go. So 16 more cards. Hopefully we can get the remaining commons we need. And we're going into, okay. Fennekin, Litten, and Bulbasaur with a Chimter Hollow. I think these are actually all new additions. Very nice. Got this Chinchar. Very cool looking Chinchar there. And Bulbasaur. I believe this is from Unbroken Bonds. I have a lot of this somewhere. Um, or maybe it's from Shining Fates. Could be from Shining Fates or Hidden Fates. Um, forgetting, but it was awesome. X and Y, I think. And um, that might actually be X and Y. Remembering. In any case, three new additions, I believe. Litten, Fennekin, and Bulbasaur. Very cool. So, we are keeping our chances alive at finishing the master set here. Starting off with Froki, Bulbasaur again, Chikorita, and Turtwig. So, I believe we have all of those. Do you have Turtwig? Yeah, we do. Okay. Fortunately, all dupes. Our last two packs here. Did we can pull that Pikachu? Um, nope. Okay. But this is a Litten, which we don't have yet, so that's nice. 
Paula Layton. Behind it, we have Tepig, Scorbunny, and Piplup. I don't remember if we pulled this Piplup yet. Oh, we have. And Scorbunny, we have. Tepig, we have. Okay, so full dupes. Looks like we weren't able to finish the master set, but we got pretty darn close. Here's our final pack. Let's see what we can get out of this one. I'm gonna try to hide the card here. Create a little bit of suspense. Okay. So that is our final holo. Maybe it can be the Pikachu, but let's look at the commons first. Oh, and as I say that, there's another common Pikachu. Let's go. Rowlet, do we have that? We don't have the Rowlet. Nice. That's a new addition, Femmican we have, and another Pikachu. Let's see up this Pikachu here. And our last hollow card. Can we get double Pikachus in this pack? Let's see. And... Mudkip. Okay. So we did get a Mudkip hollow. Picking this up. And I'll just go over real quick how close we got to the Master Set here. I believe it'll start with the Grass Pokemon. And I'm gonna guess Bulbasaur is the first card. And it is. So we got 1 out of 25 there. Um, we're missing 2, right? Oh no. So of course 2 is Chikorita. 3 would be Trico. Oh, so Trico is a card we have not pulled. Yeah, we haven't pulled Trico. But here is Turtwig as number four. Snivy, of course, number five. And oh, I have two Rallies in here. So I guess the second time I pointed out we had a Rally, we already got it. Um, what was number six? Is it Chespin? I believe Chespin's number six, and we didn't get one. At least, yeah, I don't think we got a Chespin, unfortunately. So Chespin would be number six. Rally, and of course Spooky for the eighth generation. So we're missing Trico and Chespin from the Grass Starters. Let's go into Fire next, I believe. So this is 8, we're looking for 9, which is most likely Charmander. Oh, so we didn't get the Charmander in the common, but we did get it as a Hollow right here. So yes, that is 9, but we do need to pull a common one, unfortunately. So 9, let's see, we got Cinequil, 10. Oh, we don't have a we don't have a common Torchic either. The so Torchic would be eleven. There we go. After Torchic, we have twelve, which is the Chimchar. Into the Tepig. Tepig is thirteen. Fennekin's fourteen. Litten and Scorbunny. So out of these, we actually have them all. We just don't have them all in common. Of course, that. Torchic, as well as the Charmander here. So, we need to get these in commons. Hopefully I'll be able to get more packs in the coming days. I was just able to get this one pretty early from a friend of mine who was able to get them early, like I said. So, again, shout out to him. Thank you so much for letting me do this opening early. And now, finally for our waters. Obviously starting off with the Squirtle at number 17. Squirtle, and do we have didn't get Totodile, and we do have Totodile here, so no Totodile into a Mudkip, Let's see number 20, Piplup of course, Oshawott, Toki, and Poplio? Yeah, Poplio, okay, so we're missing the newest one, which is of course the, um, shoot, okay, there it is, we got the Hollow version, Sobble. So we need a common Sobble, common Totodile, and last but not least, of course, we got the Pikachu. So, Hollow Pikachu has eluded us out of these packs, but we did get some pretty cool pulls, and we made a lot of decent progress, actually. We got two Torchics, unfortunately, because, um, well, it's like a nice Pokemon, of course, but uh, it was a dupe, unfortunately. Two Pikachu, which is nice. And, um, yeah, did a, made good progress today. Switch on the fire Pokemon, wow. And water. We got one hollow groupie, which is uh, kind of surprising. <coughs> Excuse me. So yeah, super hyped for this 25th anniversary. Obviously this year we have shiny face coming through also as part of the 25th uh, anniversary celebrations. 
people are speculating that we'll get some kind of throwback set toward the end of the year. Kind of like a evolutions or a generations from the previous year's anniversaries. I'm hoping it's a like a Neo reprint set of some sort. You know, reprinting favorites from Genesis, Destiny, Revelation, Discovery. That would be super awesome. Those are some of my favorite packs from back in the day. But that's what I'm hoping for. And of course, look out for that cereal that's dropping with some of these uh, Pokemon promos inside. And of course, tomorrow is the official street date for these uh, Pokemon Happy Meals. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I had a lot of fun opening these, and yeah, I'll be continuing to uh, get these as much as I can until I finish the set. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed that video, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.